Yo, what's up, guys? This is PR. W welcome to the uh, channel of my YouTube page. Um, uh, th that's currently uh, going okay. Uh, hopefully, you enjoyed the other cooking one, um, the one I did before. Anyways, uh, today uh, I did this uh, yesterday. Yesterday, and I did it the day before. But, anyways. This is going to be uh, an update of what you can do with your egg or your eggs and what, what I use ingredients. I'll get back to you. It's the, the, the title is called, um, in regards with the cooking, or the, the, the dish is called cheesing omelette. Alright, so stay tuned. Okay, so for your um, first step, uh, if you want to cook one egg, you got to have is your utensils, right? You got to have uh, your, your uh, what I use, uh, metal chopsticks, um, metal spatula, and have a, a, a fried with a wok, a wok pan, a wok fry pan, somewhere there, somewhere. Um, but you get to see in the pictures uh, how it looks like and how it works and stuff. Um, and what you need is eggs, one or two eggs, and what else you need is, um, hey, what else you need, I'm trying to figure out what else you need, uh, you need is uh, cheese of some sort, so what I use is parmesan cheese, or the crepes, or creepy, uh, parmesan cheese, <laughs> and, 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 um, and what else I use is self-raising flour. So okay, in order to um, thicken the egg and uh, and the cheese will make the the egg taste like cheesy. But this one is not your sunny side eggs or what whatever you call it the the, the, the eggs that they come with, just just by frying the egg and just you know this is um just it's like a squeeze it's like um it's an omelet it's an omelet. So, um, some sort. Okay, um, anyways, stay in touch, stay in tune, and stay in touch. Okay, okay, first step you get your bowl and crack an egg. Or your two or your three eggs. First of all, I'll go maximum two. Um, and you create your omelet. Now, um, um, now how, how you create your omelet is uh, you put you put that and you put like a good amount of cheese and good a uh, little bit of little bit of flour, and then you you whisk it. You whisk it. So after you whisk it. Um, you whisk until it looks even in, in the, 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 the bowl of uh, <laughs> the, the, the bowl where your eggs are so just whisk whisk and it could take up to a uh, half a minute and then um, it's very very easy very simple and after that um, that's it the, the whisking the preparation is done so all you gotta do is cook the, the, the thing, the egg, okay? Um, wait, wait, let me get back to you that one.
with your fry pan you get to choose whatever fry pan I choose the wok pan now this is the oil that I use canola oil the canola oil I use because uh, it's crispy it's crunchy and well the oil is not crispy and crunchy you know but the anything you cook from it is crispy and crunchy okay <laughs> so uh, canola oil um, this one you do you heat up your, your pan with the oil or without the oil, heat up your pan first until it heats up and put your oil in up to a certain level you have a lot of oil not a lot of oil, it's a desirable amount uh, it's on there somewhere um, uh, uh, I don't have a read uh, if you're asking for a typed up or written uh, ingredients I do not have one, I just have photos in this video um, Anyways, uh, and then you create your your, your oil. It it boils. It don't boil. It's, it's hot and goes. You know, it changes color. Not not color. It changes texture. <laughs> so so the color, the texture, the the bonding, everything, and, and becomes something else. Then you pour in your. You get your bowl and you pour in your egg. And your eggs will go blah, blah, blah. you know you crack an egg normal it goes black. This one goes blah, blah, blah. so um and you, you you turn the when it's hot you turn it down to low or you even turn it off. Now when you turn it off when you put the egg in it will be, it'll be cooking or sizzling or something and then you turn it on to low heat to control the monitor so um, the, uh, using a gas stove that's what I do but if you have this electric uh, good luck for you <laughs> um, uh, anyways and the, the next the next the, the, the thing is um, regards with uh, cooking uh, um, you, you flip it to the other side after it's nice and golden brown, uh, not even golden brown, golden yellowish brown. You don't want it too brown, but um, it's like it's like ten seconds, twenty seconds, like, you know, and you, you flip it to the other side and and you monitor it, or like just check it and then the and check it, and flip it to the other side just to double check the color and it's not good enough. You flip it again and, and uh, about ten, twenty seconds. So on a plate, it's like a minute or two, two minutes in cooking, frying your eggs. It's easy, easy. <laughs> now this is how it tastes. This is how it tastes guys. It tastes frothy. I meant to taste frothy, so it's like scrambled eggs on. It's on. <laughs> so um it tastes frothy. It tastes cheesy in the inside. It tastes um uh, crunchy and crispy. Now with the omelet, you, you might wanna eat it by itself or you can have it with sausages, you know, like your um Kransky sausage, have one Kransky sausage, have your mushrooms and uh, your, your we call it cheese on top with a bit of maple syrup you know how it is these days so uh, I'll give you a demonstration of what I did yesterday yesterday I had these um I, I had m put maple syrup in it and I put a ground pickled chili on, uh, on it because I didn't have um, chili jam <laughs> that was a joke um, uh, and then uh, I put cucumber on top and then I wrapped it and I ate it with knife and fork so um so it's up up to you guys what you want to do with it um with the omelet this is a good example uh you might want to add some mushrooms on top mushrooms on top with a drizzle of uh, 
uh, pan uh, pancake syrup that's it uh, or you can um, you can uh, uh, do anything with the omelette you know with the omelette and you wrap put something you wrap around so th th this is a, uh, a new style this is just my, my version of it so um, thank you for listening hope you guys uh, catch up on the feed and um, the world's uh, checking my videos out remember to okay whatever all right so see you bye